Our Small Business Spotlight Series is back, and today we're talking to Sasha Sr. Back in March, Sasha opened up Windsor's only skateboard shop, but because of COVID-19, she was forced to lock her doors just days after opening. She was able to quickly move Bliss Skateboard Shop online, and with more is Sasha herself joining us this morning. Good to see you. Hi. Hey, Sasha, you've been skateboarding since you were 13 years old. Why did you want to open up Bliss in the first place? Um, opening the business was never really uh, um, something that I, that I kept trying to do all the time. It, it just kind of happened this year. I just had the opportunity to do it. So I said, you know what, let's let's get it done. Let's let's do it. Let's take the chance and, and open up the shop because there wasn't one in Windsor. So that's that's kind of the main drive there. You know, what? you really feel for business owners like yourself. It takes so it takes years of, of planning, getting your money together, um, finding a space. And then to days later, be forced to shut down. So because of the pandemic, you made the really smart move and were able to adapt your store to online curbside pickup. What was that experience yes. like having gone through all of this planning to have a bricks and mortar store and then having to make a switch within weeks? It was it was a little unexpected, but I wasn't too shocked from it because, you know, we've been hearing in the news that certain things are going to happen. So instead of stressing about it, I said, OK, online just instantly, you know, rather than trying to be upset about not being able to open. And how's business going so far? It's been great. It's been really great. A lot of people are just happy. Everyone's like, I'm just so happy we have a skate shop in Windsor. So everyone's <laughs> very supportive. Yeah, and also skateboarding allows people to be physically distanced, to be outside. And it's one of those activities that even if you hadn't thought you might want to try before, now's a good time because it's COVID. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you have a single employee at the store, but you also support a team of skateboarders. Tell us about that. Um, so, yeah, my single employee here, he's he's a really good guy. He's been sticking with us uh, since the beginning. And then I've had a lot of skateboarders um, from Detroit who are on the team. And then also two skateboarders from Toronto, um, more specifically Nathaniel. He's a great skateboarder who wanted to jump on Bliss even before we had the space. Hmm. So I'm just really thankful for that and thankful for the team that's been um, holding down the, the shop and representing the shop. Uh, we're just showing our viewers... Um just some incredible footage of mm -hmm. people skateboarding in various parks around the city. Um, growing up, you didn't see a lot of skateboarders out there who look like you. Do you think having a shop like yours could get more people into this sport and into the activity of skateboarding? Oh, absolutely, absolutely. Yeah. I've had a lot of young girls come in, which is amazing. And I've had people from California, people from Mexico, people from Tennessee who are like, oh, I'm so happy about the shop. And just seeing a lot of young girls get into it has been awesome. It's been very... Uh, very, very motivating to see a lot of the young girls get into it because it's not a female dominated sport. So that's I don't know. It's been it's been really good to see that. I can see your face light up when you start talking about it. I can see it's <laughs> a real passion of yours. Um, I yeah. know you have big plans to expand your shop. How do you envision Bliss in the future? Um, I, I'd like to have another location in Windsor where it's uh, part of an indoor skate shop. So that's kind of the next or an indoor, indoor park, I should say. So that's kind of the next um, step for us. It'll take a couple of years to get to that point. But again, we don't have an indoor spot in Windsor where we can skate in the wintertime. So that's kind of the level I'd like to get to. But then world recognition too, because I want to go around the world and help skateboarders in countries who don't have the uh, accessibility to get skate products. So I want to be able to help out that way too. Sasha, I love your positivity. I love your creativity and your vision that you have for the future. Thanks so much for coming on your morning. Thank you. All the best to you in the months to come. Thank you. For more on Bliss Skateboard Shop, you can connect with them online, and here's how you can do that. Thanks for watching. If you like this, be sure to subscribe here. And you can check out more Your Morning videos right here.